Terrifying moments for a woman who woke up to a strange man in bed with her. The woman screamed. Her brother rushed in to help and tried to fight the offender off. That break-in happened early this morning in the 500 block of Webster Drive in Huntsville. WFF 48's Elizabeth Gentle caught up with the victim. Elizabeth's emotions were running high. And Mark, the woman, the victim, tells us that a man broke into her house and tried to rape her. Her brother went in and he tried to help her out, but the man got away, leaving behind, though, evidence of his visit. Kelly Dodson was asleep with a little girl inside their apartment on Webster Drive when I was attacked by some idiot from out here in the projects. Dodson says her attacker used a garbage can to climb onto the unit's ledge, open the upstairs window, and then he got in bed with her. He, he tried to rape me. He tried to pull my clothes off. Dodson struggled with her attacker, knocking over items in her bedroom. Antoine Dodson heard his sister scream and ran to help. Well... Obviously, we have a rapist in Lincoln Park. He's climbing in your windows. He's snatching your people up, trying to rape them. So y'all need to hide your kids, hide your wife, and hide your husband because they're raping everybody out here. The attacker got loose and went out the upstairs window, but he did leave something behind. We got your T-shirt. You done left fingerprints and all. You are so dumb. You are really dumb, for real. A crime scene investigator photographed and dusted for prints on the lid of the garbage can and the window pane and ledge. Dodson says he's never seen the perp before, but sends this warning to whoever is responsible. You don't have to come and confess that you did. We're looking for you. We we gonna find you. I'm letting you know now, so you can run and tell that, what homeboy. Now, if you have any information on this crime, you're urged to call Huntsville Police Department. We'll have much more from the victims of that attack coming up tonight at 6. Reporting live in Huntsville, Elizabeth General WAFF 48 News.